Adam, it's David. You in the building? Just entered the lobby. Sorry to pull you out of sick leave so soon, but uh, we've got a situation. A breaking out of Milwaukee Junction factory. Meet me at the helipad. I have to see Pritchard first. Something's wrong with my retinal enhancement. Frank's on the second floor in the tech lab. Make it quick. People's lives are at stake. Okay. So that was the prologue for this game. I hope you guys enjoyed. And now we get the first mission, I guess. Oh my god. Mr. Jensen. I, I didn't think you'd... Oh. Wow. I guess you hear about the break-in. Did you... Need directions or something? It hasn't been that long, Cindy. I may not look the same, but my memory's pretty intact. Oh, I, I didn't mean... I, I mean, of course, your memory's fine, sir. It's just that well, things have been switched around a lot ever since the... Well, since the... Ever since the first attack? Yes, sir. The lab floors were pretty much demolished. We're rebuilding them, but most of our researchers are working off-site now. Everyone else has been shuffled around, so if you need help finding someone... Okay, I want to know where's the helipad. I don't helipad. suppose we moved the helipad, did we? I, I don't see how we could have moved it. <laughs> oh, you're teasing me. <laughs> Very funny, Mr. Jensen. Go up the stairs to the second floor, then around the cafeteria to the exit. I think I saw Farida heading there earlier. Okay, they already said where's the preacher's office. You said everyone's been moved around? Almost everyone. Who were you looking for? Uh, my office. Has my office been moved? No, sir. You still have that great view of the lobby. Mr. Pritchard wanted it, but Mrs. Margulis put a stop to that. Up two floors and make a right. Fuck Pritchard. Hey, I don't give a damn about Sally's office. Right. Back. That's what I'm here for. Anything else, sir? Nah, no, I'm okay. I'll find my way. If you say so. It's... It's good to have you back, sir. Okay, let's go to visit Pritchard. I don't like that guy. Technology lab. About time. What happened? You get stuck in an air duct on the way over? Yeah, nice to see you too, Francis. Something's wrong with my retinal display. Can you fix it? If it's what I think it is, probably. Of course, it might seem. <laughs> Looks like your left and right imaging processors weren't completely in sync. But don't worry, your sentinel health implant will kick in soon, repairing any damage that might have caused. Your retinal display should be fine now. Its recognition software won't be picking up hostiles yet, but you should be seeing radar and targeting reticules. Biomedical data too, if you're in pain. Right. We done here? Because Seraph is waiting for me at the helipad. I know. Radicals have broken into our manufacturing plant and taken hostages. Maybe this time you'll actually save people. Fuck you. I'm not gonna ignore you. I'm gonna confront you. If you got a problem with me, Pritchard, why don't you just say it and get it over with? Why no, Jensen? I don't have a problem with you. If anything, I blame myself. The mighty Pritchard blaming himself. <laughs> That's gotta be a first. I'm the one who told Sarif we needed a physical security team to protect us. If he'd read my report closely enough. Wait a second. Are you saying it was your idea to hire me? Not you, Jensen. I wanted Dynacor, Sharp Edge, or Bell Tower. All the top private security contractors were on my list, but Sarif wanted somebody in house. And so did Dr. <clears throat> Reed. Okay, I'm still gonna confront. I suggest you leave Megan out of this. Why, Jensen? It's no secret how close the two of you were and let's face it you'd just been fired from SWAT for that massacre in Mexican town no one was about to hire you you really have to stop getting your news from those pikes blogs Francis they only confuse you the point is if Sarif had listened to me we wouldn't be having this conversation but Megan God love her always did have Sarif's ear Sarif's ear is gonna be hearing a report about violence in the workplace if you keep this up you really feel like continuing? Point taken. Nice. Shut up. Ebook. Nice. And I'm gonna scroll those slowly so you can pause the video and read. Oh. 
Cyberbus Pro Energy Bar. Nothing else to steal from this jerk. Nah. Okay, I wanted to check my office first. And down there. Well, Let's see what is this? Okay, I don't want to turn off cameras. Secret secretary, what is this? Ah, huh. it's my pass for my PC, I guess. Yeah. Okay, I already. Yeah, I already saw these. They are from um, Megan's PC. Uh, PC. Yeah. Oh, I can hack my PC. Password is Mandrake. Mandrake in, Ital uh, in Italian. And rake the magician. Okay. Twenty three. Yeah, I'm going to check Office twenty three. Oh, I want to do one thing and play. On, on. It's easier for me to see if I can open stuff and. Okay, 23. I guess it's on the second floor. Let me see. Yeah, 23. And I have uh, the code. Microphone muted. Microphone activated. Nice. Another ebook. Chips are like money in this game, I guess. Can Where are you, Adam? You don't have time to mess around. Get to the helipad, or something seriously bad is gonna happen. Yo, wait. I have to check. Kill things. Okay, nothing. Yes, it's me. Room 32 and 642. And 642. Ah, it, it shows me the code. So it's. On the third floor, and I'm not gonna lie, it's been tough on everyone. Because, yeah, it's it's this one. Yeah, nine six four two. Energy bar. Nothing else. Another ebook. I'm gonna read everything when I watch my videos because I, I have to watch them to check if the quality is okay and stuff like that. Password Eclipse. Nice. Nothing. Just this one is just a general email. Let's open this web. A newspaper. I think newspapers 
don't get anything, just something to read. Chips. Okay, so nothing important, I just saw this little prick is saying something. Okay, I'm gonna read this later. Another ebook. Just an achievement for getting every free book in this game. They are 29, 29, yes. Okay. I got everything here, everything there. Can go to the helipad now. You happy, David? Oh. Okay. The helipad is that way, but I want to go this way to check. We can grab something. Okay, I'm not going this way. But I can get to the helipad from there. She went. Nice. Get inside the vent. Nice. Okay. Can okay, go down. I really see something. Can I jump? Ah, I can't. Oh, 200 credits and a pocket secretary. Uh, nothing important, I guess. No. But I want to get on this floor. Nah, there's nothing I can grab. So yeah, let's head to the heliport now. Heliped now. Yeah, I see you. I want to explore everything I'd like to explore. Nice. Okay, I don't have the code for this. And I can't hack it no uh, for now. Anything else? Nah, I see a door down there. And I can't open it. So yeah, that's all. I just have to take the no. I don't have to take the mission. I have to check it here. All the contracts we lost because of the last attack and the Washington. I'm sorry if you guys don't like exploring, but I do. Beer. I love beer. That this is the second time the biotechnology firm has been attacked. Okay, fuck the TV. Time, ago, I don't like TV. I don't like TV at all. Just ads, no, nothing else. Let's talk to Farida Malik. Malik, I don't know. Welcome back, Jensen. Didn't think we'd see you around here for a while yet. You know how it goes, Malik. Duty calls. Don't I know it? I was in my wingsuit halfway to the top of the Renaissance Center when I got the 911. But you, six months is a hell of a short time to come back from the dead. You sure you're ready for this? Um, uh, yeah, sure. Or challenge? I don't know. Well, yes. I want to find out. Roger that. The boss is already on board, arguing with the DPD's tactical response team. They've got the plant surrounded, but Mr. Seraph wants you to go in first. Are you all set here? Because the sooner we take off, the better it will be for everyone. Of course I'm ready. I'm ready. Great. Then let's get airborne.
I told Farida to put us down on a roof. I don't want the crowd seeing you go in. Fine. As long as she pulls you out the minute I'm gone. So what am I looking at here? Who are these guys? Pro-human purists, or so they say. The same purists who've been firebombing limb clinics all over the country. You buy that? No, I don't think it's a coincidence they hit us today, only hours after he moved the Typhoon in for assembly line factoring. The Typhoon? Megan's team was testing it the day that bastard... Who's on point for these guys? Adam. I know you and Megan were once... Who is on point for these guys? Goes by the name of Sanders. That's him, there. He's an augmented Adam, so he can't be one of the mercs who attacked us, but he did know exactly how to get inside our plant. All right, so how do you want me to handle this? First priority is the Typhoon. I'm keeping SWAT out until you've secured it. As far as rules of engagement go, I'll defer to you. Lethal or non-lethal? Non lethal, of course. I'm not looking to start a firefight in there, just neutralize them. Okay. But just make sure those bastards don't wake up and warn their friends. You remember what it's like in there? A lot of tight enclosed hallways. But the labs themselves are pretty open. High ceilings. So, do you want something you can use from a distance? Or up close? Uh, short range weapon is... Better, I guess. Yeah, I'm gonna go for sh for for the stun gun. The closer, the better, I think. That way, I'll be sure they stay down. You got it. The typhoon should be in the factoring labs, but Pritchard will tell you more as you go in. I've got him running comms. Terrific. Anything else? Keep your eyes open for hostages. Free them if you can, but the typhoon is your number one priority. We developed it for the Alphabet Agencies, and if we don't deliver it to them intact and still a secret, well, I'm sure you'll get the job done right. 